it was really, really lovely. It was very unusual. I thought it was very cleverly drawn, and the questions that it provoked in me as a reader were fairly profound and substantial questions about the nature of man and about that time-honoured query as to what is the fundamental experience of the human being. Is it more orchestrated by a fundamental nature or by a sense of nurture or environment. Our first challenge was finding 30 qualified crew members able to cope with the stress of prolonged confinement, that and the knowledge that they won't be coming back. Our solution, breed and raise our own crew. A few years ago, two images popped into my head and um, one was a group of young people sitting around inside a spaceship, kind of disheveled, zoned out, kind of looking like they were animals resting after a hunt or something like that. And then the other image was that same group chasing another one of their crew members down the narrow corridor of the ship and you know pursuing him like an animal and then catching him and beating him to death. And I thought to myself, what, what the hell was that? What's that all about? Who are those characters? What is this? And I thought that there was something interesting there and something meaningful. And so then I started to, to, to write on it and, you know, and eventually teased out this story. <laughs>